Y'all see it. Y'all mother love to see it. Manny Pacquiao fired Freddie Roach on his day off. How the hell you get fired on your day off? Well, Freddie Roach deserved the phone call. You've been with the man 15 years. 15 years. And you don't even give him a phone call? He deserved that much. Even though Freddie Roach had it coming. He sat up there and remained speechless as Pacquiao got fouled an innumerable amount of times by Jeff Horn. He didn't say a word as Jeff Horn put Manny Pacquiao in UFC headlocks, MMA chokeholds. He remained silent. And that cost you your job. That led you to get fired on your day off. So now you can sit up here and, and try to sell Avon, uh, Mary Kay products, but you won't be training Manny Pacquiao any longer because of your negligence. And it was overdue, man. We sat up here and saw Amir Khan fire Freddie Roach, uh, not teaching any defense. Now Manny Pacquiao was the latest to fire Freddie Roach. Freddie Roach, he's slipping, man. You're slipping. Not to mention you've been all in the media uh, doing interviews, saying slick shit about Manny Pacquiao was his fault that the Floyd Mayweather fight didn't happen. When we all sat up here and saw Floyd Mayweather duck and dodge Pacquiao, talking about he was afraid for his health, bitching about uh, blood testing, you had a nerve to sit up here and go in the media on Dante's channel uh, talking about it was Pacquiao's fault. All these events led you to getting fired on your day off, Freddie Roach. But in your defense, yeah, you, you did deserve a phone call. That was foul. That was cold from Pacquiao. I expect more from Pacquiao. He's the consummate professional. He should have gave you a phone call letting you know uh, your services were no longer required. But y'all let me know what y'all think about Manny Pacquiao uh, firing Freddie Roach on his day off. A 15-year relationship ended without a phone call. Damn. Drop me your comments. Hit that like button and subscribe. I'm out.